Hello, hello, hello. Good afternoon, good evening, good morning, and welcome. So, this is a little uh, Sunday evening, just waffle, bit of chit chat. Nothing much going on, really. Um, busy in the back garden for about four hours today. I'm sure the uh, video for that will be coming soon enough. Um, so yeah, we might, we made it for the first week in January. Um, New Year's resolutions? Yeah, got loads. So, <laughs> what have I done? None. Oh, none, Mrs. B says none. Mrs. B does not do New Year's resolutions. Shall I pan round and show you where Mrs. B is and Max is? Do you want to say hello, Mrs. B? Look, so we've got the fire lit. We've got a bit, a bit of Bob and Shaw on, the, on YouTube. There's Max in front of the fire with a black with a with a, with a with a with a blanket over him. And there's Mrs. B. Hello, Mrs. B. Warming our toes after a roast. Warming our toes after a roast Sunday dinner. Night chill. Sunday yeah. night chill. So, you know, it's January, first week in January. Not much going on. New Year's resolutions, that's yeah. what I was talking about. It's talking about New Year's resolutions. Uh, no, I don't believe in them anymore. I used to, but then no. I thought, no, it just puts you under pressure. Does it? it puts you under pressure. It does. It puts you under pressure to perform in January, which is the dullest month. It's been rainy and horrible. So it was a bit dry and bright today. So that's why I was out in the garden for ages and I'm making. But did I have any New Year's resolutions? I hear you ask. Yes. There's what, How many things are there? Four things oh. I've done? Oh, you want us to go without <clears throat> gin for January? No, 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 forever. Gin for January. No, for no, forever. For you. No gin forever for you as well. I know. I'm living with an alcoholic. <laughs> I drink less than you. Yeah, yeah. yeah. That's because you have one gin and I have ten. Yeah. So when you say let's have a gin, you have one, I have ten. Yeah, and then you say you can give up for January as well, and I'm. What? Yes, you you'd give you, yeah. In for a penny, in for a pound. We're a team, remember? <laughs> team Bryn, Project Bryn. <laughs> you know? So, what are my New Year's resolutions? I'm going to try and get this list out before Mrs. B butts in. She's going to put in. <laughs> right, first one. First one. It's like gremlins. First one. I'm only allowed to eat between 12 pm and 6 pm. Outside of those hours, if I eat, it's like feeding gremlins. No, feeding mogwai. They turn into gremlins. Yeah, they're not gremlins. So it means that I'm only allowed to eat from, I have lunch and I have dinner. Nothing else. No tea. No, I have dinner. No snacks. No second dinner. No breakfast. No third breakfast. Fourth, third, fourth or fifth breakfasts. No, I'm not a hobbit anymore. So yeah, so that's the first rule. Second rule, low carbs. So everything's got to be less than 5% carbohydrates that I'm eating. So I'm eating well. My, my, forever I'm, or just... Forever. So I'm getting I'm getting paddle board fit. That's the, that's the plan, right? So when, when, this, when the good weather comes... The before picture of me. Yeah. Before not and yet. after. Not yet. Yeah. The before and after. So plan is right when the sun comes out and everything opens up i want to be rather than look like a sea lion getting onto my paddle board i want to look like oosh like that sprightly and oosh i got a wetsuit i got a black wetsuit and honest to god i look like a black jelly baby when i'm wearing it so that's that's got to stop no more of that so um what else so yeah so Intermittent fasting, only eating six hours a day, nothing for 18 hours. Loads of water, I'm drinking loads of water. That's uh, low carb. Um, what are the other things? No booze, but we're not doing dry January. That's that's just this fad. It's like, me, dry January, look me. Why are you doing it? Are you going to let me off? <clears throat> no, you're, <sighs> you're not drinking. You've got, you got a problem as well. I've got a problem. got a problem. I have got a problem. Yeah. I oh, don't right. drink very often. On the first, it's nice to just have 
Yeah, okay. On the first day of February, have you got it in your calendar that you're going to get in tanked up? I thought you just said, no, I never get tanked up. No. Um, so, are you saying that we're not doing dry January? We're not dry drinking. Dry January is a fad, so I can No, do the whole tonight. dry January thing is a fad, but we're just not drinking. You're not. We're not calling it dry January. I'm not. So I, I think she have is. So I one this evening, could I, Sunday night? You can do, but I'll, I'll have to go for a walk. For, <laughs> and, <laughs> honest, right, I'll, you can... I'll go in the cupboard and drink it. Yeah, well, well, look at that, click. So you can have a drink, right? You can have your, your gin and tonic tonight, but you've just got to say, uh, but as long as you don't mind me saying to, to you, oh, you tried. Like this. Oh... You did try. I hardly mm. drink them Christmas. Like that. So, the thing is, right, December for me is like anything goes in December. I think last year, oh no, year before last, I put two stone on in December. Just from eating McDonald's like every well, day. I put sort on of stuff. Wait over Christmas, so surely I'm allowed Doesn't to. Doesn't make any difference. Your liver I'm will allowed. be thanking me. Your liver will say, thank you. What are the other things? See, we're digressing. I'm no. Uh, this is going to be a really long video and it's just waffle. So what are they say? So intermittent fasting. Intermittent fasting. Low carb. No booze. I always do 10,000 steps a day. That hasn't changed. I went back to the gym. But then I went back to the gym and overdid it and couldn't feel my arms a few days later. So um, I'm like, I'm going to go back this week. But, you know, I haven't recorded very many videos um, in the last week. Because oh, 2022 has started off to be stupidly busy with my day job. So um, so normally I'll work for one company and because uh, I'm, I'm a contractor, so I work, you know, wherever I'm needed. Normally I'll work with one company, happy days. But this time around, I took on a contract and I negotiated for four days a week. So I'm only working four days and the plan was, was to take every Friday off so that we could go in the caravan every pretty much every weekend or lots of weekends. But that's just failed miserably because I got contacted over Christmas um, to do some work for a actually for a charity um, who need me two days a week. So now for the foreseeable future. I'm working four days a week with one company. And I'm maybe working two days March. a week with with another. Yeah, yeah, probably till March, but maybe longer. So I'm working six days a week at the moment, um, which wasn't the plan. So this weekend has been super busy. Um, did first four days with the first client. Then I worked the whole of Friday. I mean, really long hours on Friday. Worked Saturday. Um, so I had today off, I had Sunday off, and I've just been doing all the stuff in the uh, in the back garden and then I'm starting again it all starts again tomorrow so that's where we are on the work front what else is going on Mrs B yeah we're just watching a bit of Bob Earnshaw I love oh, Bob Earnshaw are we watched are we allowed to talk about what we watched on telly yeah if you want we watched we watch? this morning oh we watched Johnny we Vegas recommend, recommend yeah. That. yeah channel 4 go on to all 4 search for Johnny Vegas he's the, there's 4 episodes of him building a glamping site using old buses, and it's brilliant. It's good. I think I think Johnny Vegas. I think from that program comes across as really, really nice guy. I think really genuine yeah. guy. He's had a shed load of bad luck. Um, but yes, yeah, so we watched that. We watched that in bed this morning for a bit. So what have we done today? What have we done this uh, week? I've just been working, working, working all week. I've done a few jobs um, this weekend. Saturday was working. Yesterday didn't really do much. Oh, I brought the uh, I brought the gaming laptop in the yeah, house with VR headset last night, and I was uh, I was getting chased by zombies, and yeah. Sarah could see me on the on the laptop screen. A bit too scary for me. I don't know about. Yeah, I actually found that hilarious. Whacking a load of zombies with an axe. Yeah. Yeah. So that was we played that till about half nine, and then we were in bed by ten. Yeah. I started, well, started watching that Johnny Vegas thing and Mrs B kept on drifting off so we watched it this morning instead. Oh, so what did we do this morning? So we, we got up, rather than taking Max for a walk, we went in the truck and we actually drove to a little CL site It's just down the road to see, see where, it was. where it is and what, you know, what the route there is going to be like. It doesn't look too bad. There's a little 
little country lane, but there's loads of pulling pulling in spots down this lane. So then we went to Lidl's. To take uh, yeah, to take uh, take something back to Lidl's. Then we got home, and I got just got distracted. Oh no, we popped out with Harvey for a bit, and then the rest of it we just uh, I got distracted in the garden. I literally went out went out in the back garden and just stuff happened. Moved load of uh, a load of wood, oh, loads of firewood from uh, one part of the garden to the other. But uh, I recorded a bit of it, so I might stick a video together if I remember. What else is happening? Oh, last night, bought the laptop in here and got carried away booking trips. Booking weekends. Booking weekends here, there and everywhere. Yeah. So opened up the calendar and there's a few, there's a few, there's loads of big gaps where we weren't doing anything. So we just I know, but put a few things in here and there. I don't know about going away every weekend because yeah. we want no. the kitchen, part of the kitchen really needs painting this year and I want to paint mm. in here. Yeah. It's painting in here really this it's year. It's out painted for like six I'm, years. Are you telling me I'm going away on my own? Uh, no. <laughs> I'm not going away on my own. So, no. So I've got to find some time to do other yeah. jobs. Yeah, so there's, there's, you know, we can't go away every weekend, even if we'd love to. I don't think we've got anything booked for quite some time now. We were going to go to Broadway, um, rescheduled yeah, Broadway weekend. for the summer because everything's closed. It's the, the railway, which is the main reason to go to Broadway, is actually closed, which is a real shame. Um, but yeah, that's about that, really. Anything else from you, Mrs. B? No, I don't think so. Waiting for the long winter nights to be over and mm. to get lighter because I think in this weather you just gets dark and you just want to go to sleep. Good bed. Yeah. Early to bed, early to rise, that's me, I think. Yeah, you're in bed by half nine. <laughs> Not at six. Yeah. Max has been poorly, but he's better. <clears throat> yeah, Max has been really ill. Um, he's better now, I don't being, know whether we said no. it, we? I don't think we did. He was really, really sick. When was that? After New Year, wasn't it? Last, last weekend. Last weekend for about three days. Yeah. So he's Vomiting been... Vomiting and diarrhoea. Mm. Stomach cramps. I don't know if you found mm. something and ate something or um, just picked up a germ in the mm. grass. His tummy was going know. like... Blah, blah, blah. Tummy was making some horrendous noises, but he's pretty good. He won't eat sweets. He tends to just eat meat meat or cheese, you wouldn't mm. eat fruit or sweets or veg or anything like that. Yeah. So I don't know, but luckily it's out of his system, thank God. Yeah, he was up all night, I had quite a few sleepless nights. Took him to the vets and the vets gave him a good check over and gave him some anti-sickness stuff. You weren't um, really sure. No. They just, they just sort of say, well, if he, you know, if he doesn't yeah. improve, Put him on a bit of chicken and... Yeah, he's fine now, look at him, he's living the dream. Rest up and he'll either get better or not. Yeah, so he's our guard dog. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, the other thing, uh, all these New Year's resolutions, I didn't say. Mm. All these New Year's resolutions got on scale small and I've lost eight pounds in eight days. Yeah. Don't know why I went four, it's four times two. Mm. So, uh, yeah. Trying to get fit and healthy again. Um, doctor put me on these statins, which I don't want to take these statins, so I got sort of my cholesterol myself. Um, I've got an appointment with a diabetic nurse. She keeps on phoning me. She said, when are you going to come and see me? I need yeah. to do your bloods. So I'm putting her off until I've lost three stone. <laughs> and then after I lost that three stone, the party begins again. Yes! No, only joking. So, are you uh, are you still desperate for your gin and tonic, Mrs. B? I'm okay. <laughs> I'm just going to drink it in the cupboard. You won't see. You won't no, know. that's it. I'll just be a sneaky drinker. You're going. You're going the downstairs <laughs> loo and be drinking it. I mean, <laughs> darling, darling, where are you? Oh no, no, no. <laughs> nothing to see here. <laughs> Is that right? Yeah. Just put it on there. So yeah. That's that really. That's our Sunday evening update. We watched um, Rob and Lynn on tour. They did a live 
thing live at five travel chores they do live at five but I don't know we could do a live one day what do you reckon I know you might get a bit <clears> like <throat> dumbstruck and go um do I ever get dumbstruck and go uh, no very chatty but yeah, yeah you're right. it's just our life really it's yeah. nothing no it's just what it is it is what it is. I was thinking about doing some videos. <laughs> this is how we go for this. I was thinking about changing the format of some of the videos, and at the beginning, doing a voiceover and doing something like, um, like last time on Project Brin, like that. Yeah, couldn't it? Yeah, yeah. And then at the end, do like, are you laughing at me? What? <laughs> Pointing the camera at me. Oh. There you go. She's like, what if I can't live with? And then you could do like at the end, you could do like, next time on Project Brin and like that. It'd be really good. Mm. Well, I don't know. A random life of us, isn't it? Yeah. There's not much going on at the moment because the weather's really pants. January, isn't it's it? It's January. Diddy, 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 diddy. That one. Um, yeah, there's not much going on. We're just trying to book stuff up to keep, keep us sane. Um, looking forward to the end of the month because then we're closer to sunshine. Yeah, I can't remember when the clocks spring forward. Last like last weekend March, in March, like normally, that, isn't it? it? So, uh, things really, yeah. that's when the fun begins. Well, there's not any real jobs we need to do on the caravan either at the moment. Oh, someone's still got their Christmas lights on there, didn't they? Oh yeah, one of our neighbours has got their Christmas lights on. They've probably, they've both died. They might be in the hallway. <laughs> Sorry, I'm getting told off now. They haven't died. They're not in the hallway. They're obviously fine. They just haven't taken them down. Yeah, Max, your phone's going to be Yes. Is you? Yeah. So, well, anything else? We've waffled on long enough. We have. We get bored. We do. We're doing next week. Nothing next week. No, see what the weather's doing. We could go out for a walk, a drive somewhere, yeah. maybe. Yeah, it's good, good weather next go week. Go over the day, go out in Missy. I think we should stay in Missy on the drive next weekend. I checked on her last night, and everything's good. Mm. She hasn't, there's no leaks or anything. Good. Hello, everything seems funky. So, right, do you want to say goodbye, Mrs. B? Bye. Bye. Say bye bye, Max. Bye bye. See you on the next one. So, yeah, remember, do a little Sunday night update. It'll change your. I'll do the voiceover. I'll do the voiceover, shall I? Whatever you like, darling. <laughs> do a Sunday evening. This isn't. And this is without any alcohol. Yeah. So, I know. Comes me down. Pulse, oh, damn, I had my pulse earlier on when I came in, it was like 100, 120 yeah. beats resting. I don't know, I've got glasses on, I can't see the Fitbit. It's probably less. But there we go, right. Do you have a Fitbit? <clears throat> yes, voiceover time. Um, <laughs> you're laughing at me, you're laughing at me. Right. I used to have a Fitbit and it drove me mad, so I got rid of it. Yeah. What so, did you have? What did you have? I used to have a Fitbit, but it drove me mad. Yeah. So I'm free of it. Yes. See, I'm still shackled to the to the app. But uh, well, first thing in the morning when you wake up, you look at your watch to see how well you slept. You don't go, oh, how well did I sleep? You go, how well did I sleep? And you look at the graph, see what points, see what score you got overnight. Oh, I got 81, yay! It's never that accurate, I do. It's not. I'm waffling still. Right. Yes. So like, you said goodbye, didn't you? Did you say on that note? Not that I know, I don't say that anymore because it's really annoying. I used to say it all the time. So, Mrs. B's got her feet in front of the fire again. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, yeah, so, uh, so do a Sunday evening update and it will change your life. See you on the next one. Bye bye. Bye bye. Goodbye.